We're back at the Cassie Barn, um, right off the, the far turn on the track, barn number 29. You got Papa Cap going tomorrow in the Amsterdam. How's the horse training? He's training well. He's just happy uh, when the entries came out, there was no Jack Christopher. What did you think of that race and how the, uh, the field came in? This, uh, this, it's not an easy race. I mean, very competitive. I think four or five, six horses could win it. Um, hopefully it's us. You have horses all over the place this summer. You're up in Canada, you're here. Um, any two-year-olds that you're really excited about? Well, I love Wonder Wheel. She uh, broke her maiden in Presley at Churchill and then um, came back and won the debutante. So uh, impressively, uh, we're gonna we're gonna run her in the spinaway here at last day, I think it is. So you, very excited about her. Horse up here training already? She is, she is gonna maybe have a little breeze tomorrow. Um, in terms of the size of your barn up here this year, we spoke to a lot of trainers. Some guys are smaller, some guys are bigger. How's your barn looking size-wise up here? Well, we're a tad bigger. I think normally we're 30. The limit's been 30. Um, this year we have 32, so uh, a little bigger. You had a nice horse yesterday in the Curlin. How'd the uh, horse come out? He's fine. Um, I think I'm going to send him home. He's, you know, been going long and hard. He was on the Derby Trail for a little while, uh, Golden Glider, and and I'm gonna send him home. He's gonna become a gelding and uh, get a little R and R and get ready as a four-year-old. I find this time of year, I'll, I give a lot of my three-year-olds the rest of the year off and let them grow up. Let, yeah, let, sorry. Last question for you: um, Any changes with your plans for this uh, this coming fall with the Belmont and the uh, the Aqueduct meet change? No, I don't think so. You know. We're, we're not real prominent in the fall in New York anyways. We'll, we'll have the same amount of horses. We'll run some in, uh, at Aqueduct, but not really. Well, thank you very much and good luck with the 2022 meet. Thank you. Back at the Abreu Barn, um, Venti Valentine, workhorse for the barn this year. Uh, I saw it back on the work tab up here at Saratoga. How's the horse been working? She's been doing really well. She had a really nice breeze this morning. I arrived on up, up 100 this morning. She breathes really well. Have you nominated or pointing her towards anything yet? I'm gonna run her in the Fleet Indian. Okay, so you got a couple, a little, little time before that. Should should give time to round in a little bit. Well, yeah, she had two rough starts. You know, she ran the Kentucky O. That was a pretty tough field. She had a bad experience there. Yeah, we bring her back in the Acorn and she ran fourth at a poor horse field. You know, so we're just gonna try to give her a little class relief. Talking about uh, two-year-olds up here, you have quite a lot of them. Can anyone you're really excited about? Well, I was excited about two of them that already ran. We got a bad post on one. The other one got annihilated leaving the gate. I have another one in tomorrow that's been training pretty well. Who's in tomorrow? Her name is Check Engine Light. Okay. Um, in terms of the claiming game up here, you're not a claimer, but you do have a couple of horses dropping in. Um, it seems like this is pretty crazy with how many people are going in for it. Is, it. is it more of you put it in there knowing what can happen and you're afraid to get it claimed away? I mean, you know, it's a challenge because sometimes you want to just win a race here. You want to drop in so they could have a little class relief and you don't come back with the horse. Last question for you here. We've seen, uh, talked to a number of people. Some people are larger than they are normally. Some people are smaller than they are normally up here. What's the size of your barn looking like and are you looking to grow it up here? I got a pretty good number. I got about 45 horses. I have 30 here in Saratoga and I have 20 down below um, Belmont or 18 around there. So I have a pretty good number. Two-year-old mixed, two-year-old, three-year-olds. Are you going to be going after anything in the auction, possibly? Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's always, always go there. Well, congrats so far on this meet, and good luck with the rest of the meet. Thank you so much.